so we got all the products. If you're watching the video on Facebook, YouTube, and some of the clips on Instagram, you'll see that there's uh, 10 boxes behind uh, Jeff. So how many flavors do we have right now? And, and I assume there's more coming. Yeah, we are. Uh, so we like to create. Um, we've got 12 okay. or 13 flavors. So we have 12 retail available and our 13th is actually the one we made for the food bank which gotcha. is funny because some of the people go i actually love that one <laughs> where like, can i buy it <laughs> we send that? you know and you're like oh maybe we should yeah figure that out but yeah we've got that um i would say like i said right now our, our best bet um is website yeah. kaisconcepts.com or amazon um amazon we've had problems with quality stuff so we just started self-fulfilling sure. some of that but a lot of great local retailers too. I mean, yeah. um, probably too many to name, but uh, we can send yeah. them in the notes or whatnot. So, what you mentioned, there's the, you know more more coming, but there's got to be some some uh, like recipes that are just like these are you know the testing ones and you're like i can't put this into production but this one's so good yeah like there's got to be some secret i'll tell you if we could do something fun that would really help us if we could do like a fun survey of like flavors or types of things that people would want so we've we've toyed around with a lot so as i told you kind of off air um one of the things i've realized is uh something that i think we have is just being a manufacturer yeah so we've had other people reach out that want us to make bars for them and so um i love that part i like the idea of sitting across it reminds Mm -hmm. me of when i was honestly doing kind of the life coaching or health coaching it's like what's your dream what's your vision what's in the way and how can we help you overcome that and bring that to life um and so boy, we've worked on some flavors there and learned some new things and tested some new ingredients. So like we did this white chocolate macadamia one. We did this cashew coconut one. We did a birthday cake, which my struggle on the birthday cake is I can't find a clean and simple sprinkle. Yeah. And I've been told you have to have sprinkles. (laughs) So that's one of my big questions. If listeners want to message or say anything, I'm going, you know, if 99% of the product is, you know, the same the whole birthday cake. dense, yeah. solid ingredients. And then one is like this, whatever yeah. is in the sprinkles. Is that like cool? And does that seem to be on brand or yeah. like with that? Cause you know, all our stuff is clean and simple and, you know, nutrient dense or whatever. But, and then we've been working on some high protein bars okay. for some other people. So trying to decide, you know, if we should pull that out for our brand as well mm-hmm. or whatnot. So like I said, we've, 